Anya Haseo. Welcome to another Taekwondo class with me, Master Daniel Clark. We're gonna go ahead and learn a lot of other cool things today, but of course, we've gotta start off with a warm up. We gotta get that blood moving and we gotta feel excited and ready to go. So let's go ahead and start off with some hops. So we're gonna go ahead, make sure your feet are separate, okay? I don't want your feet together like this, hopping together like this. I want your feet apart and we're gonna just do nice little hops just to get moving. So go ahead and jump up and down. Uh, make sure you're doing this at home, moving around around is so beneficial for you. If you're maybe having a tough day, I always like to get some exercise. It makes me feel a little bit better. What we're gonna do to make this a little bit more engaging and fun, I'm gonna say turn. And you're gonna turn the same exact way that I turn. So try to follow with me. Ready? And turn, face this way. Good, all right? Just like that, okay? Nice, good hops, front. So face the back front, good, doing great. All right, ready, turn, turn this way. All right, keep hopping, keep moving. All right, ready, and front. Good, 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 keep it up, keep it up, keep it up. And turn, and front. All right, listen, watch, ready, turn. Oh, make sure you're going this way. Stay with me, here we go. Front, turn, front, turn. Good, nice and fast, react fast. Front, turn, front, turn. Nice, okay. Now I'll say switch. When I say switch, switch the all the way to the other side. Okay, ready, switch. Front, turn, this way, keep up. Switch, switch, switch. Ooh, did you stay with me? Let's try, keep going, come on. Front, turn, switch. And front, good, and stop. All right, very good. Feeling a little bit heat in your legs. Let's go ahead and let's move on to running. So we're gonna run in place so that we can get our knees moving. So I want you to make sure your knees at least come up to where your waist is. Or if you're wearing a martial arts uniform like me, up to where your belt is. So, ready, let's run in place. On your mark, get set, and go. Run in place, get those knees up. Don't go way down here. This looks like I'm a, I don't wanna be here run. This looks like I'm a super excited man running. Yeah, all right, good. Up and down, keep it going. Let's do the same exact thing we did with the hops with running. So when I say turn, you're gonna turn the same way as me. Ready, turn, this way. Good, good, good. All right, and front, nice. Ready, turn, other way, good, and front, keep it up, doing great, turn, front, and turn, front, are you guys getting better at this, is this easy, turn, front, good, turn, good, run this way a little bit, front, good. turn, front, good, turn, Keep those legs up, front. Don't let your knees drop down, keep them up. Almost there, turn. Good, and front, and stop. Woo. Nice work, yeah. way to keep moving. All right, let's go ahead and get our arms warmed up. So we're gonna swing our arms forward and back. Really loosen up those shoulders, and we're gonna use our arms a lot today. We're gonna do a lot of blocks and punches. So really concentrate on moving these arms and getting them ready to go, okay? Go ahead and stop. Let's go ahead and do arm circles. So arm circles just like this, nice and easy. What you wanna do is you want to work on your shoulder flexibility. So you don't want to just go fast like this. You wanna actually make sure you go a little bit slow and make sure you squeeze your arms back. See how far back you can put your arms on the way back like this. So you not only move and loosen up those arms, but you also try to get a little bit more flexible too, which is so important, especially in Taekwondo. Good, all right, stop, go the other way. Nice, easy circles, okay? Again, going back, really squeezing those shoulder blades together, just like that. 
Getting those arms nice and loosened up and ready to go. All right, looking good, keep it up. Okay, stop. Okay, arms out, feet apart, legs bend, and we're gonna move our body left and right. This, you gotta make sure you be very careful and go nice and slow and easy, all right? You don't have to force this, especially since we're working on our torso. You really don't wanna injure your back or anything like that. So take this nice and easy and just loosen up your torso, just like this. Good, good, good. All right. All right, you guys ready to get started? We're gonna really ramp up the Taekwondo drills by getting into our horse dance. So when you get into a horse dance, let's review. You wanna make sure your feet are apart and your legs are bent just like this, okay? Part of traditional Taekwondo is you want to make sure you're strengthening things at the same time. So if I stand like this, my legs aren't working at all. You wanna make sure you bend your legs, okay? When you bend your legs too, you're a lot stronger. You're, you're able to not be knocked down. You are more stable, so that is what you want. So bend those legs, all right? We're gonna go ahead and re review and do our high blocks, all right? If you don't remember our high blocks, you can watch our previous episode where we have those high blocks that I teach you. But I'm gonna really quickly just show you, you have one hand that comes right here, straight up, and the other hand that comes straight back. Let's go ahead and do 10 high blocks, and I'm gonna count in Korean. So try to follow along. Ready? Here we go. And, hana. Do, set, net, tasso, yoso, ugo, yodo, aho, yo. And on the 10th one, when I say yo, give me a loud, remember, kia, which means shout. Make a loud noise. Show me your fighting spirit. It's like that. All right, ready. Let's go ahead and do our inside blocks. Remember, inside blocks here. Cross your body. This hand, pulling back. Let's do another 10. Ready, here we go. And, hana, two, set, net, tasso, yoso, ugo, yodo, aho, and last one, yo, Good job, okay. Let's go ahead and do our down blocks now. Make sure to stay in that horse stance, bend those legs, strong legs, strong legs. All right, here we go, ready. And this hand right here to your shoulder, down, and this hand back. Let's go, here we go. Hana, right here. Do, set, net, tasso, yoso. Here we go. Yodo. Aho. Yo. Good job. Okay. We're almost there. We're going to go ahead and do a couple punches and a couple double punches. Ready? So, punches, super easy. One hand out, one hand in. Make sure your punch comes from here and comes straight out. Let's do 10 of them. Here we go. Ready? Hana. Do. Set. Net. Tasso. Yoso. Hilgo. Yodo. Aho. Yo. Yeah. Good job. Let's do double punch. So every time I count, do two punches. Just like that. Here we go. Ready? Hana. Do. Set. Net. Tasso. Yoso. Hilgo. Yodo. Aho. Yo, yeah. good job, okay. Last and final one we're gonna do is we're going to do 30 seconds of punching. So I want you to give it all you got and punch as long as you can. Well, not as long as you can, just for 30 seconds, but as hard as you can for that 30 seconds. Are you ready? Don't give out on me yet. Let's be strong. 30 seconds, on your mark, get set, and go. Keep going, don't stop. You're almost there. You're halfway there, don't stop. 10 more seconds. And five, 
four, three, two, one, big punch. Yeah! All right. Good job today. That is our warm up. We're gonna go ahead and teach you a form soon, but we'll see you in the next segment. Thank you for warming up with me. Hey there, real quick tip for you. So when you're kicking, you're, if you notice yourself losing balance, I'm gonna give you a quick idea on how to keep your balance a lot better. So here, I want you to do a little experiment. I want you to stand on your toes like this, as high as you can, and then try to keep balance on one foot. Ugh. It's kind of hard. Now try that same exact thing, except bend your legs, and now stand on one foot. Okay? Way easier. So as you're kicking, it is completely okay to keep that back leg or that supporting leg bent as you're kicking. And I promise you, you'll be closer to the ground, more stable, and you'll have an easier time keeping balance, just like this. All right, hope that helps. We'll see you in the next segment.